Hey guys, Standing Night Flyer here, and today, for this probably Christmas video, uh, it's literally only Christmas because I'm putting Christmas music in the back as you can hear about now, um, I thought, let's, instead of sit, let's stand up and we'll talk about my work experience. This is the second time in my life doing work experience, and I'm not, I know, I'm going to sound like the, um, Oh, I can't remember his name, you know the one that worked at McDonald's for 24 hours and he was going mental, he's like We're cooking! We're actually flipping burgers! Oh, it's this madness! Like the video! Aha! I'm gonna get paid minimum wage today! On top of the fucking millions I get anyway! Yay! But yeah, sorry, um... There's a little tangent, but yeah, uh... If you guys didn't know, which you probably didn't anyway, because I don't think I said too much about it I had to do work experience, it was like 40 rough hours for my course and I did it in a radio station and that's why the title literally says something about radio station because I'm probably going to make up the title later on but yeah I'm just going to tell you how it felt um, to be honest it was kind of boring but like I, I get why because I couldn't really do too much because they already had everything set up Realistically, I just had to sit in and just make sure the desk is working grand, the mics were okay, the headphones okay, you know. Um, oh man, I'm sorry, I'm already tired. Man, I'm so unfit. Um, but yeah, like... Oh, other than that, I won't really talk too much about the boring parts, I guess. I'll actually talk about the parts where I was on air. So it was like three times when I got to be on air. It was like ten minutes on a on the sports section of the show and uh it was the worst because i did not know what to say i was trying to keep up with your uh, host on the other end and he was just talking about oh yeah so this and rugby was all cool well, what do you think joseph i'm like yeah that's really good that they're able to beat them and then <laughs> then they just continue oh i'm glad the actual co-host came in but he came in late and shit and kind of got a uh, scolding but other than that the next Time, or the next opportunity I got was literally the same day, but I was doing a whole segment instead of like just 10 minutes and It was pretty fun though. The guy's like pretty chill. We just talked about like Halloween and I guess we just talked about movies and stuff as well like as much as we could like it wasn't that awkward It was actually pretty good. It's like I was just talking to a mate on air. It was the best I, I even loved the outro where it was like I'm your host da -da 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 -da, joined by and then it's a long pause, and I'm like, wait, shit, am I meant to say something? <laughs> and then we just both laugh, we're like, oh, sorry, sorry. Um, yeah, that, that was fun. And then the last time I got to be on air was interviewed about my, um, oh, whatchamacallit. Oh, my college course, there we go, Jesus. And pre pretty much there was meant to be two interviews, but my little interview took place instead, because, like, they needed filler, they needed something. And they just questioned me. They were going to question my mate and stuff about Brexit. And he was like, nah, 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 I'm good. I don't doubt him, to be honest. But uh, yeah, other than that, like, I didn't really learn anything else. Except, well, to try and have a lot more patience than I did for the job. Because when I got in, I usually get in, like, an hour or two before I actually am due. Literally because of bus times. And, like, man, I'd be going an hour up and back every day for like a few hours of work but I'm so glad it ended on Tuesday and then I sweat the festival of the lost and I got it done within Wednesday I still have like as, as I'm recording this I still have like a triumph to do but like there's nothing left for me to do in festival except collect Eververse stuff and it's nearly impossible to collect Eververse stuff because Bright dust is just not that easy to come by anymore. It comes in very small quantities. The only other way I can get it if I get the rest of Bright Engrams in the season pass. But, uh, yeah. Um, I don't think I have anything else to say. If you guys want me to make like a follow-up video, maybe, questioning me about work experience, what I found, and this, that, and the other. Maybe even from the last work experience, if I remember stuff, because I kind of kind of have. And I one thing I will say, sorry if my camera's kind of dark. I, I guess it's just because I'm pointing upwards this time instead of pointing it directly to the window. Um, but I thought this would be cool, like nice little change, even though I literally just had my hands on my desk and 
was just doing this the whole time. So I, I better go now, guys, because my nose is uh, dripping like hell. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you liked it, like the video. If you didn't like it, dislike the video. Comment if you want. Subscribe if you want. And hit the bell if you do so desire. I'm Dark Knight 4 and I'm signing out. Thank fuck dog, I got that working experience done, man.